My name is Yana Kempler and I'm joining you today from It Plus. And today I'm going to show you a leg workout that is going to improve your running techniques and is going to make you run stronger. So one of my absolute favorite tools of all time is the BOSU. There are so many things that you can do with a BOSU that will improve your leg strength. So the first thing I want to show you is the BOSU lateral jumps. And the reason why I like this one is because as runners, we're usually always moving forward, but we're not doing enough side to side movements. So in this case, what you wanna do is you wanna get started like this, nice and low, and then you just do very simple, very simple side to side movement. And as you get better at this one, you'll notice that you're gonna be able to go a lot faster And if you do this one enough, you're going to feel a burn in your quads and a little bit in your glutes. And it also helps to stabilize your ankle a little bit to get you used to being on unstable surfaces. And now, this next one is the single legged glute bridge. So with this one, what you want to do is you want to lay down Dig your heel into the bow suit and then lift up. And this right there is going to burn your glutes a little bit and then you just go up and down. You see, your glutes are a really big muscle, and therefore, the stronger it is, the more efficiently you're going to be able to run. And you want to do the same non repetitions on both sides. Now this next one is a little bit trickier. So what you want to do is you want to do side leg raises while you're standing up on the BOSU. So you want to grab, you want to stick your foot in the center of the BOSU and get a solid stand on it. So now you're standing on it like this. Now don't walk your knee. Keep that core engaged and you're really working on your balance. And once you've got a solid balance going, then you can start to lift your legs sideways a bit. And what you will notice here is that all the muscles around your ankle are engaging. All the muscles around your hip and knee are also engaging. And then you're also engaging your gluteus medius on the leg in which you're lifting. And then you want to do the same thing for the other side as well. So get a really solid foot plant. And then you're staying, getting your balance going. And you're lifting your legs sideways. And make sure to keep your knee unlocked. And 
And again, you want to do the same number of repetitions on both sides. And the reason why I like this one is because as runners, we're, with each stride, we are standing on one foot. So if you can stand on one foot extremely well, then you should be able to eventually learn to run extremely well. Now this next one is the weighted step up. I like this one because it works through glutes and quads. So what you want to do is again, do the same number of repetitions on both sides. And you want to tighten your core and engage your glutes and go up and slowly go down, moving back up and go down. And again, you want to watch that your knee doesn't go over your toe and that you're really focusing on that full engagement. And do the same thing on the other side. And now another one that we can do is this one. So you're standing like this. So it is a bit of a lateral movement, but again, you're engaging your glute. And you're going over like this, and you're stepping up sideways. And then the weights are just there to add a bit more resistance. And then the switch sides, After 15 reps per side, this one really burns. And another one that I really like is the straddle jumps. So these can help build your explosive power in your legs. And if this is too high, you can always bring it down lower. You can start even with something like this. All right, so that concludes our leg workout of the day. And uh, I would like to see all of you become stronger runners and decrease your chances of injuries. And I hope that you will all join me in 2020 when I launch my new strength training program for runners. <laughs>